Thanks for your service. Thank you, sir. Thanks for what you did. Thank you. Good. Thank you. It would be a presentation that was years in the making. It's very special, very, very special. Charles Riffle once again has decorations reminding him and others of his sacrifice. Riffle fought in Korea. As an Army infantry machine gunner, he led other soldiers on the front lines to replace a platoon that was wiped out by the enemy. It was tough on me and tough on the kids that I was the squad leader of because I didn't know what I was doing. After 14 months in Korea, Riffle would return to the U.S., eventually retiring from a job at the hospital in Newport. He'd then move to Hayden. But all of that didn't bode well for the Army medals he'd earned from his time in Korea. I don't know what happened to him. I've moved four or five times since I was out of the service, and I really don't know what happened to him. Now that he's close to 90, the medals became important to Riffle, and he wanted to get them back. So friends suggested he reach out to Senator Jim Risch's North Idaho office to see if he could get replacement ones. And sure enough, Thank you. Riffle will once again be able to proudly display his medals. It was exciting to hear that they were coming back. A veteran who's not about seeking the spotlight simply wanted to offer thanks to those who came to Haven City Hall. He'll now continue working with the local VFW and he'll hang on to this hardware. Well, obviously, these aren't going to get lost. In Hayden, Taylor Vito, Crimson News.